hi friends uh, we learned in previous video product rule right and now here we're going to learn uh, the generalization of the product right we're going to generalize the product rule right so to generalize the product rule let me take some functions right uh, let me take uh, my first function is suppose f of x right and another function gx right and another function uh, suppose hx right so f g and h are my three functions right and I'm going to uh, generalize the, uh, the product rule, right it means uh, we are going to find out the derivative of the product of these three functions right so uh, with respect to x so a derivative of the product of these three function that is fx dot gx dot hx right so what will be the derivative of these three functions the product of these three function how to find this right so what can I do here uh, I can suppose this two as a one right as a one I can suppose and this I can suppose as a second function this will be uh, now I'm going to use as a uh, this uh, fx and uh, dot gx this both as a one and this hx as a one right so this will be my first function and this will be my second function so uh, our, uh, I'm going to rule the product rule line uh, I'm going to use this product rule for this uh, product of these three functions and our product rule is uh, derivative of the uh, u dot v uh, is simply not I, I'm not going to write in the u and v I'm going to write in the form of g and f and fx and gx right so derivative of fx uh, dot gx right fx times dx is equals to first uh, first function times the derivative of the second function right and again second function times the derivative of the first function right so same thing will, it will be here so what I can write now I can write simply uh, the first function that is fx times gx right times the derivative of the second function that is d by dx of hx right and now again uh, second function times the derivative of the first function second function that is hx times the derivative of the first function that is d by dx of fx dot gx fx dot gx right so uh, now what I can write here fx dot gx times fx dot gx times derivative of the hx will be h prime x right and again uh, here hx times derivative of the fx times gx that will be uh, first function times the derivative of the second function right and again uh, this is in the bracket right uh, second function times the derivative of the first function f of x right I'm just going to uh, disclose this bracket so it will be now here here is here fx dot gx right times h prime x again uh, plus right uh, so again here it will be now this hx times gx times right g prime x again plus right so here it is now hx times gx again hx times gx times again here the f prime x f prime x right this is exactly the uh, product of this three form right uh, product of this th three functions that is uh, product of two functions and the product of uh, uh, product of two functions will be multiplied by the uh, uh, will be multiplied by the derivative of the third function, right? And again, uh, product of the first function and th second function will be multiplied by the second function. Uh, uh, it is I think hx fx. Sorry, I'm sorry. This is fx, right? Uh, fx. Uh, product of the first function and the last function will be multiplied by the derivative of the second function. And again, product of the last function and the second function will be multiplied by the second function, right? so uh, to write it properly I'm writing here uh, uh, as a formula here so the derivative of the fx times gx times uh, hx right derivative of the product of the three functions is equals to uh, derivative of the first function right times the product of the rest of these two that is gx times fx again derivative of the second function right derivative of the uh, second function times the product of the rest of these two that is first function and second function 
right uh, we can write like this also or uh, if you want to write it will be something like this uh, it will be more better if I'll write like that mm, well fx times g prime x right g prime x right uh, I should write this with a different color g prime x again uh, plus fx times gx times f prime x sorry h prime x h prime x right so uh, simply what you have to do uh, if uh, you are just going to find out the product of the suppose this one is a first function second function and this three one two three is this uh, three f uh, functions one two and three right this 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 means first function second function and third function right and you are going to find out the derivative of this right f of x uh, sorry <laughs> derivative of these functions you're going to find the derivative of these functions then what is it, it's simply derivative of the first times second and third again uh, uh, derivative of this uh, simply uh, derivative of the second uh, right uh, well now fine derivative uh, now one times derivative of the second times third right and again one times two times derivative of the third right uh, to to write it simply uh, simply I, I just want to tell you just write one times two times three again one times two times three right again addition by adding one times two times three and uh, now give the prime in first then in second and then in third this is exactly the formula of the derivative of the one times two times three right so the derivative of one times two times three is derivative of first derivative uh, then t product of this two three right and again uh, second and then third here okay right just write one two three one two three one two three three times and then and then uh, write the prime in first second and third just th this is just to understood you right uh, don't write exactly like this it's just to under understand or uh, to remember the formula right I hope now you understand the generalization of the product right so now we are able to uh, find the derivative of the product of the three functions al also right so now let me suppose here the, our first function I'm just giving now here example right so our first function is suppose um, 2x and our second function is suppose um, suppose uh, what should I write x square right and our third function is suppose uh, mm, I'm taking something different different uh, sin x right and our third function f uh, g h x is our suppose mm, tan x right uh, well so now uh, I, I'm going to find out the product uh, derivative of this fx dot gx dot hx right so the derivative of this will be now as I told you simply right uh, derivative of the first function right derivative of the first function that is derivative of the 2x right uh, d by dx derivative of the 2x times the 2 sin x times tan x now again uh, a little bit right derivative of the second uh, it will be here right so the first one uh, first one is 2x 2x time derivative of the second that is d by dx of second was uh, second is the sin x right and times the third one that is tan x right let me take in the bracket and again plus uh, the first second and then uh, derivative of the third that is first is 2x second is sin x and the derivative of the dy by dx uh, d by dx of tan x right so what we will get mm, well uh, derivative of 2x will be simply 2 times sin x times tan x right and here again 2x times derivative of the sin x is cos x times tan x right again plus here 2x times uh, sin x and derivative of the tan x is sec square x right so like this we can easily find out the uh, product of the th uh, three functions right uh, I hope you understand this generalization of the derivative uh, the generalization of the product right so um, you can do uh, such kinds of problem a lot right and uh, uh, well <laughs> we'll be meeting in the next video with a different type of concept in the derivative okay bye bye